And hello to you from the English Midlands. We're here at the King Power Stadium. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Leicester City taking on Manchester United. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Number eight, Yuri Tielemans. Number 25, Wilfred Endini. Number 17. Well, here's how Leicester City will line up. Kasper Schmeichel stands between the posts. Ricardo Pereira plays with Ryan Bertrand in the fullback positions. Wilfred and Didi start with Yuri Tielemans in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Jamie Vardy. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. David De Gea begins in goal. Rafael Varane plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Paul Pogba plays with Fred in central midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. And the contest begins. Really bright looking attack. The danger averted thanks to his teammate. Rafael Varane. United might be able to cash in. And he takes it on. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Short corner routine. Fred. Can't miss, surely. And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Now a short corner here. Now can they counter clinically? Defenders need to cover. Ricardo Pereira. Perez. Ndidi. And using his strength to shield. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. Corner kick played in. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. Tielemans. Ndidi. Alert defending. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Can they keep it going? 
but it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending how can he take them on and beat them and no way through Shaw Bruno Fernandes has it still on level terms moving the ball nicely Cristiano Ronaldo Fred and return to Ronaldo making sure nothing untoward happened Bruno Fernandes far from a good pass intelligent threaded pass here Ndidi well, the attack carried an initial threat but fizzled out Cristiano Ronaldo Fred Pogba has it good looking ball can he play it in well, Paul Pogba able to deal with the threat and the referee blows for a foul Tielemans it's a perfect challenge Bruno Fernandes and return to Ronaldo Sancho will he finish and he's outdone himself wonderful save there He's driven in the corner. Goalkeeper's ball. It was always going to be that way. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Ricardo Pereira. Now indeed he. A potential danger. And nicely struck. And the post getting in the way. Well, the keeper has it and all is well. Well, it is now, but the striker did everything right, barring a couple of inches. Well, the stats tell us everything. They just aren't doing enough going forward. They've been too predictable and far too slow in their build-up play. They need to do something different to get the breakthrough. Encouraging stuff from United. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Greenwood. Well, if truth be told, he made it rather straightforward for the keeper. Well, he knows it. That is a real waste of a great opportunity. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Vardy. Let's fly here! Well, fantastic reflex action. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? And over comes the corner. Well, not cleared away completely. Ndidi. 
Madison. Clean challenge. Fred. Mason Greenwood. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Bruno Fernandes. And blocked for now. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Getting in there to intercept. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. He must finish! Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Well, nothing untoward happened. Must take the lead here. Bruno Fernandes. Bruno Fernandes has it. Options in the middle. They really look after the ball when they have it. Jadon Sancho. Tremendous challenge. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Will they profit from this situation? Well, that break looks so uh, promising, but nothing coming from it. Just 10 minutes to go. Jaden Sancho. Might be able to set up the chance. Space and time for the cross. Oh, fine save. And it remains all square. Well, he saved his team there. That's a big moment for the keeper. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Number 23, Luke Shaw, to be replaced by number 27, Alex Tellis. Over it comes, and he clears the danger. Alex Tellis, an attack full of promise. Can they forge ahead? No! And all because of the goalkeeper, margins, margins. Well, he has done well there, but he should have won the game. They probably won't get another chance now. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Number 17, Ayoise Perez. Coming onto the pitch, number 11, Mark Albrighton. Keen to take it short here. Fred. Now Pogba. Fred. Ronaldo. Can he put them in front? He does. And with so little time left, that might be the winner. Wonderful drama. Well, here's the replay, and what a well-delivered cross this is. Perfectly placed, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Well, there goes the final whistle, and really annoying for Leicester and their fans. Not at their best, and three points dropped. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me, and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now, and they can't afford a repeat performance. Well, in the final analysis, a spectacular contribution from Bruno Fernandes. Eye-catching stuff all round, and Stuart...